gosh, where? This vehicle is so cute. Is this like a kid car? Oh my gosh, that is the cutest thing in the world. Hey guys, my name is B and welcome back to my channel or welcome on in if you're new to my second channel. You guys, it is update day and as many of you guys know, I wasn't actually going to start posting on my Bloxburg channel until my brand new roleplay, The Coopers, starts next week. But since a new update came out as a small surprise update, I thought it would be exciting if we talked about it now rather than waiting. So as you guys can see, I'm here inside of Bloxburg right now and this is actually a brand new toddler update you guys so this whole update is mainly focused around toddlers so i'm gonna pop up on screen for you guys the current update log this is everything that is new in the game we'll go ahead and read down it and then we are going to explore around it so we have added toddler age added toddler and kids themed items furniture and food added little wheels convertible and off-roader added layered clothing support increased outfit accessory max limit most structurals can now be re sized with skill tool and major bug fixes now the actual layered clothing support you guys will see is working because normally when i play blocksburg if you've seen any like videos or streams of me playing blocksburg before i actually don't have my layered clothing on the like cropped sweater that i wear in most roblox games because it wasn't actually working yet as you can see it's now working so i now have my little sweater on which looks super super cute so of course you guys there is also a new game game pass that we're going to talk about so i'm going to go ahead and show you guys that so to get started before we go into any of the toddler stuff we're going to talk about the new game pass if you guys go into the store you can see it says marvelous mood if you go ahead and click on it you can go ahead and buy the new game pass which we will do essentially it is going to increase the time in which your positive mood lasts by decreasing the time it takes for the negative effects to actually happen to you guys and increase the time that the positive effects will last so if you guys see i now have marvelous mood it's going to mean that my mood related things is going to go down a lot slower so we'll go ahead and boost my mood and it should take a bit longer for my mood to come back down again all right you guys so now let's go ahead inside and check out the new toddler age so if we head on in and we'll head upstairs to go and find a dresser, you guys, and we can go ahead and get changed so that we can show you the new toddler age. So I'll head over to the dresser, we'll click customize character. And as you can guys can see up here, we have the default right here, which is the adult. Then we have teen, which obviously we've always had, which is just a bit shorter than the adult and obviously a little bit more, um, I guess... I guess you're a bit shorter and you have slightly different things that you can do. Then there was Kid, which we've always had as well. Now you will see there is a toddler option and there is, of course, the usual baby option. Now, if I got, if you guys go ahead and select baby option real quick and then we come out of that, you guys will know that the baby option does cause you to crawl. So you can't actually get around as easily as a baby and obviously you will randomly cry. Your needs are increased much, much more rapidly and it can be a little bit annoying. But now... If if you're playing in a role play like I have, you'll be able to age up to a toddler, which allows you to actually walk around, as you guys can see. So as you can see, you'll now be able to walk around as a toddler, still playing a younger person rather than having to skip straight to a kid. But you will also have some animations and things that you do like that, where I just wiped my nose, which is very indicative of things that toddlers do, of course. Now we're gonna go ahead and age back up to being an adult, you guys. Obviously, that is our main look. So we're gonna go ahead and head and wear my main outfit to stick with the consistency of the gameplay and then we are going to head out because we are going to go and check out all of the new toddler items that have been added to the game guys go into build mode you can head on into your build section click on new and the couple of things that we have that are non-toddler is we do have a new little wheels off-road vehicle oh my gosh wait this vehicle is so cute is this like a kid car Oh my gosh, that is the cutest thing in the world. And then we do also have a little wheels cruising. Oh my gosh, convertible, you guys. That is the cutest thing. Oh my gosh, I love that. Okay, and then in the decorator section, we do have a ton of new toddler items. 
So we have some modern kids beds, you guys. We have got some Simplicity Kids beds. We've got a play kitchen for toddlers to pretend in. We have dresses. We have chairs. There's bean bags, you guys. I'm going to grab some of the assorted items. You can get markers and crayons now. So obviously you'll be able to place those markers and crayons down in areas and play with them if you want to. There's toy cash registers, you guys, which is so cute. And there's also little decals and things that you can put down on stuff so you can stick that onto things as well and then if we go back into the decorate section you guys can see there's corner shelves there's a wire mesh basket which i'm assuming is for you to fill with toys and things there's hourglasses there's scissors calculators wire mesh memo boards kids crayon and drawing set sort of like a kid's drawing on it there's a little tiny tots table you guys and there's a trash can or empty bucket there's a rectangular tissue box some other tissue boxes tape dispensers post-it notes tableware and some other various pieces of furniture so if we come out of build mode you guys can see some of the more in my opinion exciting items obviously we do have the little bean bag which i do look a bit silly in and then the cooking section you can pretend to cook you guys obviously you can't cook real meals in it since it's just a toddler item item but you can have a look you can also interact and change the picture you guys so i can go ahead and we'll swap that to that for example you can set the picture on the kids drawing and the kids can also drive around inside of the little wagons you guys so if i head back into build mode really quick i'll just pop a dresser down real fast so that we can get changed go ahead and put down in dress them and then we'll come out of the build mode i'll just go ahead and customize and turn back into a little kid so if we go down into a toddler you guys you will be able to ride inside of the little cars and drive around in them which is the cutest thing in the whole world you guys i absolutely love this look how cute this is i can give my kid a little car to drive around and play with in the yard which is literally the cutest thing in the whole world i absolutely love that you guys i'm so glad this new toddler option has been added i know a ton of people wanted it so i'm really glad to see it now obviously you guys the mood game pass is going to be one of the main things that adults are going to want because you'll obviously be able to set your mood now which is definitely going to help you guys a lot when you come to play the game there is an increased outfit accessory max now as well so the limit is increased and for the builders out there the new structurals being resized to the scale tool will probably be really helpful for you guys so there's a lot of things that you can enjoy inside of this and come and play with so make sure you come and check out the new update and make sure you subscribe to this Bloxberg channel you guys ready in advance for the release of my brand new roleplay next week the Cooper's roleplay which is coming out very soon and I'm so excited for you guys to see it we have been working so hard on creating this super cute aesthetic area and I can't wait for you guys to see everything we have been working on thank you so much for watching this video a little means if you enjoyed it please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe welcome to the new channel and i'll see you guys in the next video goodbye